space, the final frontier, a galaxy far, far away, the cosmos, whatever you call it. In this year of social distancing, the universe got a lot closer. Morgan Brennan now on how 2021 is blasting off. Dragon, SpaceX, go for launch. Despite the difficulties of 2020, space was a bright spot. Lift off of the Falcon 9 and Crew Dragon. Go NASA, go SpaceX, Godspeed, Bob and Doug. This year, Elon Musk's SpaceX became the first commercial company to carry people to orbit. Welcome aboard, Dragon. And to do so from American soil for the first time in nearly a decade. Expect the momentum to accelerate in 2021. SpaceX plans to also fly private astronauts to the space station. Boeing hopes to catch up with more tests for NASA in the coming months. And Virgin Galactic looks to send its founder, Sir Richard Branson, to the edge of space as the market for space tourism finally gets, well, off the ground. Experts say it is an incredible time to be investing in this emerging space economy. This is one of the greatest wealth creating opportunities of the last 50 years. The last 10 years has been a transformational decade of growth and we have passed an inflection point for sure. And 2020, for example, was a record year um, for space infrastructure investment. And we see no signs of slowing in 2021. Next year, NASA is hoping to send commercial robotic landers to the moon ahead of astronauts later in the decade. Jeff Bezos Blue Origin could launch its new rocket, New Glenn, and SpaceX will continue to test fly its giant starship as well. Spacecraft from three countries, including America's Perseverance rover, will reach Mars earlier in the year to gather data. And next fall, the Hubble Space Telescope's successor may finally head to space on a major mission to study the assembly of galaxies and the origins of life. For the news, I'm Morgan Brennan. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.